What's up Smarties? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Aggie and I'm a dermatology nurse practitioner talking about career, skin, and lifestyle here on my channel. So if you're interested in any of those topics, feel free to join us by hitting the subscribe button down below and joining us. Would love to have you. In today's video, we're talking about five different jobs you can work as a nurse practitioner. Jobs that I did not know anything about, to be honest, until I did some homework, did some research, because I'm really big on exposing people to what they can do with their degrees. You do not have to be limited to what is standard or typical. There are other other ways you can use that degree and let that degree work for you after you work so hard to earn it. If you're interested in what those jobs are, then please keep on watching. So the very first job is working as a travel nurse practitioner. Did you know that was a thing? Yeah, you could travel as an MP. Just like travel nursing has really taken off in these past two years, I feel like everyone wants to be a travel nurse, like for real. And I understand why, trust me, I used to work as a travel nurse and the hype is real. Well, you could also do uh, traveling as a nurse practitioner. They're also called a locum tenens nurse. And similar to travel nursing, you basically are filling in um, a need at a certain practice temporarily on contract. And similarly to travel nursing jobs, it is quite lucrative. So if you are someone who likes to travel, who has a lifestyle that can afford to travel, then consider being a locum tenens nurse practitioner. The second job you may not have heard of is working at a university or even at a school as a nurse practitioner. Um, and what I mean when working on a campus is like at the campus health or university health clinic, um, working as a provider, and really you're working with the students, maybe even the staff to fulfill healthcare needs. So it could be both primary care, primary care, uh, it could be gynecological care. Working on a campus health is something I never really thought about, but I could see myself definitely enjoying. Um, and so if you also like working with young adults, um, if you like the you know university uh, setting, then that might be of interest to you. And then the third option is working as a cannabis nurse practitioner. I think these roles are quite on the newer spectrum, but there is definitely a demand for it. So as a nurse practitioner, you are using that advanced degree and taking on that role as the provider and teaching you know, your patients about proper usage, um, side effect profile when it comes to medical marijuana you're also acting as the on-site medical authority. Something else that's really attractive about this role is that it is quite lucrative. Uh, from my research, the average pay, um, you can make up to 140K a year, which I think is quite handsome. Now, of course, all these ranges, these pay ranges, they will, de they will depend on what state you live in, but hey, 140k a year does not sound bad to me. A fourth job that you can work um, as a nurse practitioner is a on-site corporate nurse practitioner, which means you work for a clinic in a corporate setting, providing primary care. You could be helping with safety um, classes or exercise programs, medical screenings. Basically, it is a clinic that um, allows people who work for that corporation to obtain their healthcare needs. And usually it's gonna be a team involved and you will be one of those team members that are able to uh, give out those services or help with those services. So if you are interested in integrating into the corporate space, I would assume that they have really great benefits. That's like totally an assumption, not based on fact, but that could be something that's interesting too, especially just judging it up. You know, you're not working, you know, in the hospital setting or your typical like, you know, private practice per se. You know, it's kind of very special, unique in that it is a corporate health clinic. And then the fifth job I wanted to bring to you guys' attention um, when it comes to unique nurse practitioner jobs, working as a cruise ship nurse practitioner. 
Again, in my previous video, I mentioned being a cruise nurse, but along with nurses, they need providers. So yes, you as a nurse practitioner could also travel the world on sea and get paid to do it. Um, you are there to address healthcare needs on the ship, um, and that could be a range of things. So it's almost like first responder meets healthcare provider and you are kind of leading the management of those, those cases, those patients on the ship. Well, those are all the jobs I have in today's video. If you like these kinds of topics and you want to know more about what else you could do with your degree as a nurse or a nurse practitioner, comment down below and let me know if any of these jobs interest you, which one seems the most attractive, which one are you the most surprised by or intrigued by. Um, let me know in the comments. I would love to chit chat with you guys. That's all I have for you all today. I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.